Dance is expressive. Dance expresses the natural being. Everybody has a form of movement, and everybody registers their signature by the way they move. I mean, I can look at a person, and I can tell by the way they move quite a lot about them. And it's going to be a truer perception, probably, than most everything they're going to tell me about themselves. The dances that succeed are the dances that are truthful and consequently transcends time and generations because lies don't survive. People always are a little bit scared about dance. They feel like they have to know something before they can go to it and it's just not that way. You just need to go and enjoy the experience. Titus is a 42-year-old organization. We're a presenter. We are what people would think of as a theater, but what Titus is, is a presenter. We bring the international touring companies to Dallas. Where we have really been impactful on a group of dancers has been through the master classes. Every major dance company that comes to us does a master class. It's open to the public, it's free. And I can name people who got into a major dance company by being seen in a master class. I got involved with Titus through being a student at Booker T. Washington Arts Magnet. I have had such a wonderful performing career, and I say that I owe a lot to Titus all the time, but I really, I really do, because how else could I have seen so much dance as a kid? My first paid gig was through Titus and Command Performance. You can go to an audition in New York and it's so much harder to be seen and then you do a master class with 20 people, you're front and center. I think dance for a city is the same that all arts and culture mean for a city. It is really about the soul of the city. It's a creative economic engine. The greatest return for a city investment is on the arts. Thousands of people that are on salary in the arts, we are supporting jobs, we're supporting restaurants, taxes, everything. The most interesting cities that we go to are cities that have arts and culture at the center. At a Titus production, I want people to, you know, to take a risk and go see something they maybe have never seen. And there's nothing that replaces that live experience of being in a theater with a group and seeing a performance that's so extraordinary that you're left speechless and then you jump to your feet. That is what we're after. There are things that you learn as a dancer that you cannot learn any other way. They do not rationally make the decision to become a dancer. Recognize that that person understands something deeply that you can connect to, that we're all connecting to and we're all believing. The only time they feel their body is really alive is when they're moving. Movement is inherent in all of us. Some of us are really good at it, some of us are less graceful about it, but everybody moves. So I think the heart and soul of dance is a child dancing in the rain. <laughs>